What's your problem? Claire. Hey, ready for the next race? Already you here. Me or what? I'm waiting. You want to use your own ride, or am I bringing Beast? Beast. It's time to unleash her. Can't keep a spit-shined animal like that caged up in your garage. Well said. Meet there, yeah. Rancho. Be right there. See you then. Take a look under the hood before we start, see if all's okay. But stay close, just in case. Not worry this will get you killed. What, today? The race? Why? I'm not asking about just today. It could be, though. Or the next one. The one after that. Chew of mine got shocked and killed by a faulty toaster in her own kitchen. So you know, it is what it is. Case her all's around. Our chances, how do you see him? Well, it's gonna be tough to beat out Luigi. And he's got Margo riding Gunner today. Right, so... The girl loves popping flats, but don't get hung up on it. Let it mess with your head. Just focus on the route, let me handle the entertainment. Sorry, you need a minute to kick the tires before we get moving. Sure. to try.
fucking god, we won! We're finals bound! Yeah! Hell yeah! Don't stop yet, okay? Move up a bit further. What for? Need to talk. Something you should know. Okay. Sit down for a spell over there. to tell me something? I mentioned Dean before. My husband, yeah? Wheel to your heat, right? Sweetest man I ever knew. We were friends before my gender transition. He brought daffodils to the hospital. It's a new beginnings, he said. Were you married long? Twelve years. Dean used to laugh that for our 15th, said he'd finally talked me into my first implant. I was prepping some surprise. Hey, you mind if I ask why you don't sport any chrome? I love machines, V, I do. But I don't ever want to become one. Is that weird? A little, I guess. But it's fine. Dean. Only person who could have convinced me to chrome up. But guests will never know if he'd have managed, huh? Why tell me about Dean? Meaning, uh, why now? He died during a race last year. The final. Not your standard fatality, though. What well, you saying you feel at fault for his death? Me at fault? Why would you think that? He was flatlined by a Corpo Eagle Weasel. Peter Sampson. Exceptional walking rot. What's the Corpo's deal? Doesn't really matter. It was only ever another adversary to me. But to Dean. Dean and Sampson had a history going way back. Did something happen between them? Dean never admitted anything, but yeah. Yeah, there was some kind of strife. Something personal to their rally rivalry. When Samson came first, Dean got hot and bothered. Your husband. How'd he die exactly? We'd just powered into the final straight, Samson peeling up the tarmac ahead of us. It was clear we couldn't win, so Dean let up on the chew. And then that snake slammed on the brakes. Dean also had to. Lost control. Yeah, but isn't that how this race works? You don't get it. Road was clear to the finish line. He would have won. It was premeditated. You 100% sure the killing was deliberate? Not your emotions talking now. No. Saw them argue to the crack of the starting gun. Kill that bastard. During the race? Folks die on the track all the time. Won't seem unusual at all. Another day at the races, in line with the rules. And if Samson doesn't show for the race, what then? <laughs> He'd never miss a chance to puff out his chest. He'll race. Circuit champ last year. No way he'll let that go, not try to repeat. And me? Guess you want my help to zero him. Killing Samson matters more than taking first. We have to make a choice. Sorry I lied to you, V. So? It means a lot to you, this. So, yeah. Let's bury the bastard. Thank you. This... It's important. I need it. See you for the final? That's right. Till then, V.